My grandfather would say it, and I can't say it in Italian, but uh, in America, the streets are paved of gold, but you gotta bend down to pick it up. talk all the time sitting around a fire like what if we could hire all of our family and friends what if we could all work in this awesome shop and it's enjoyable to come to work every day the flexibility and the excitement and the uncertainty that comes with all of it all of us wanted to be entrepreneurs but I don't think any of us actually thought it would happen the first three years of the business, it was just my brother and I, and we were working in this tiny little basement shop. Having a successful job that pays you a check every week, them giving that up and starting this, you worry about them having a roof over their heads, being able to pay their bills, and they did not want it to ever spoil their relationship with each other. We're not just punching a clock. Our livelihood depends on this product and how well it's designed and how well it's made. I mean, my entire family is perfectionist, so anything that we come out with, it's just something that like has to either like fix something or solve something or be better than, than everything else. It's got to be something that you would want and like and continue to use yourself. So we really try to focus on making a quality product that looks good too. Wallets kept falling apart on me, so I came up with this idea for a wallet made of a single piece of leather and no thread stitching. We used solid brass rivets. There's a reason American Made has such strong marketability. It, it really does come down to quality. In the end, we are so thankful to all of our family, friends, and customers who support us every day and allow us to continue building our American dream.